will need an eight millimeter socket wrench for this project. The first thing we need to do is loosen all four screws around the casing. Now it's time to lift up and pull out the old engine air filter. Once you do that, grab your new engine air filter and let's go ahead and put that into place. It goes right in just like the old one came out. Make sure it's pressed all the way down so you can seal it back properly. Once you do that, start the process of actually putting all the screws back. There are four. Once all four are tightened, you're all done.